After the last couple of years, many businesses are struggling with endless absenteeism from stress and burnout. Leaders are expending enormous amounts of effort trying to engage, motivate and encourage disinterested and depleted employees. This is because these organisations understand that increasing the health of their people raises the health of their business. The problem is, most organisations keep going about improving their employees' health in the wrong way. They keep giving their people the ingredients of change. The lunchtime yoga sessions, the fruit bowls, the step challenges, the discounted gym memberships. But change is created through implementation, not information. Cooking recipes don't just give you the ingredients, they also teach you the method. To make change last, your people need the method in the recipe for health. How to take the vital ingredients for well-being and apply them in their busy working lives. Without knowing what it takes to make healthy change stick, your business will continue to waste time and money pumping out well-being initiatives that don't work. Making lasting changes is about building your people's skill power, not willpower. My keynotes give your employees the skills to make change happen. No one leaves my talks without knowing the method in the recipe for health, the exact steps they need to take to create the changes that will not only improve their health, happiness and productivity, but will also bring about a lasting ROI in your business. Ultimately, when it comes to it, healthy habits equal healthy business. It's time to stop losing money to burn out. It's time to boost productivity, engagement, mood, momentum, and your bottom line by empowering your employees to take control of their health. It's time to make changes that stick. I thought her talk was absolutely amazing. She was super engaging. I will definitely be able to take little snippets home and, and I will definitely be putting in practice um, a lot of what she said. So um, I really, really enjoyed the talk and couldn't recommend it highly enough. <laughs>